Yo, what's going on YouTube? Closer Look Official back with another video and today I woke up to a ton of messages on Insta talking about Virgil Abloh's done this, Virgil Abloh's done that. I had no idea what they were talking about but now that I've caught up with what's going on, we're going to talk about it. So for those of you who don't know anything about the current situation, earlier today or late last night depending on your time zone, the Off-White founder and Louis Vuitton artistic director Virgil Abloh uploaded this to his Instagram story. It's basically a screenshot showing a $50 donation he's made to help fund bailouts for protesters who are taking part in the ongoing George Floyd protests. It reads, The Miami community, I'm crazy inspired. For kids in the streets, they need bail funds for George Floyd protests. Then there's a $50 payment confirmation and underneath that he's talking about matching the local energy which is basically him adding other people who also made donations. Now let's be clear. A donation of any amount to a good cause is never a bad thing, but when you start posting on social media, especially as a well-known figure and multi-millionaire, the rules that apply to normal people don't really apply to you anymore. If you give people even the tiniest of chances to get onto you, you should 100% know by now that they will get onto you. That's just how it goes these days and unfortunately for Virgil Abloh, he's walked straight into this one. Personally, I don't think the actual donation is the issue. I mean, yeah, it's a tiny amount relative to what he could afford to donate, but who are you to really tell another person how to spend their money? I think the real issue comes from him posting the screenshot because by uploading it, he's made it seem like it was significant, whereas in reality, it's not, especially for someone in his position. Many people have taken him posting the $50 donation as a slap in the face, even more so because other notable figures have used their posts to pledge thousands to the movement or to say that they're happy to cover the legal expenses and the release fees of protesters. At the end of all of this, the biggest thing that confuses me is how we couldn't see this coming. In the current state of social media with fake outrage, cancel culture and all of that stuff, how could someone in his position post something like this and not think it would get criticised? Unless of course he knew and this was his plan, but even I think that's a bit of a reach. Anyway, that's an update on the Virgil Abloh situation. Drop your thoughts in the comments and let me know what you think. Don't forget to like, subscribe and stay tuned.